Welcome to Art Making at Home with the Rollins Museum of Art. I'm Alana Nagy. A pattern is a repeating design. Today we'll be creating our own repeating pattern design tiles inspired by the artist Jasper Johns. Before we get started with our activity, let's look at our materials for today. You'll need one sheet of paper, a pencil, colored pencils or markers, a pair of scissors, and some tape. Now let's learn a little bit more about our artist Jasper Johns. Jasper Johns was an American artist born in Augusta, Georgia in 1930. He was one of the most famous American artists of the 20th century and is most known today for his abstract expressionist style paintings. Abstract expressionism refers to art that does not show something recognizable. For example, instead of painting a bowl of fruit, an abstract expressionist artist would paint shapes and colors that were not meant to represent or recreate a real object. This kind of image is called abstract. Through different shapes, lines, and colors, abstract expressionist artists wanted their artworks to express a feeling, emotion, or idea. This entitled screen print from 1977 is part of a series of paintings and prints John's created from the 1970s to the 1980s. All of the artworks in this series were focused on cross-hatching techniques and repetition. Artist Jasper Johns used repetition in his artwork. Repetition is a pattern repeating over and over again. If you look at the tiles in our gallery, you can see the same tile pattern repeating over and over again. Now that we've learned about artist Jasper Johns, let's take a moment to think like an artist. Abstract expressionist paintings were often meant to make the person looking at them feel an emotion or an idea just through lines and colors. How does Untitled make you feel? Why does it make you feel that way? How else would you think Jasper Johns could have showed the idea of repetition in his artworks? For today's activity, we'll be inspired by the repetition found within Jasper Johns' Untitled artwork to create our own repeating pattern design. To start our activity, grab a piece of paper and fold over the corner to create a square. Use a pair of scissors to cut off the excess paper. Grab some markers or colored pencils and start drawing your design. Draw a design just in the middle of your square piece of paper. Make sure to not touch any of the edges of the paper and leave some extra space at the left and right sides. Now you're going to take your piece of paper and fold it over. Then use a pair of scissors to cut it in half. You can place your design back together to see how it lines up. Then you're going to take the bottom piece and put it on top of the paper. Then flip it over and use some tape to connect the two pieces back together.
The seam between your two papers should be in the middle. Now you're going to fold your paper over to the right so that another seam will be going across the middle of the paper. Use a pair of scissors to cut it and some tape to connect the two sides back together again. Now that all your pieces are connected again, grab your markers or colored pencils and continue your design in the middle, connecting all of the edges. Again, make sure to not touch the tops and bottoms of your paper. You just want to fill in those extra gaps in the white area. Now that you're done drawing your design, use a printer scanner or take a picture of it with your smartphone to upload your design onto a computer. Once you're on an image editing website like Canva, take your picture and make sure your image is on a square surface. So for mine, I'm using the size 8x8. Next, click your design and drag it to one of the corners. You should see that it lines up perfectly. Copy your image and paste it, then drag it over to the other corner. Copy and paste again until you filled all corners of the paper. Now you've created your own repeating pattern design inspired by artist Jasper Johns. Thanks for joining me today to create a repeating pattern design inspired by artist Jasper Johns. Check out more of our art making at home videos. Happy creating! Subscribe to our channel for more videos like this or visit us online at rollins.edu forward slash RMA to see all of our K-12 and educational programs. Mm -hmm.